The Austrian Green Party German, Die Grünen, Die Grün Alternative, lit. The Greens, the Green Alternative is a green political party in Austria. The party was founded in 1986 under the name, Green Alternative, Grün Alternative, following the merger of the more conservative Green Party Vereint Grün Österreichs United Greens of Austria Vigo, founded 1982 and the more progressive party Alternative Liste Österreichs Alternative List Austria, ALO, founded 1982. Since 1993, the party has carried the official name Die Grünen, Die Grün Alternative Grün, but refers to itself in English as Austrian Greens. There are still differences between the former members of the old Alternative and Vigo factions within the party, reflected in the differing approaches of the national and state parties. Apart from ecological issues such as environmental protection, the Greens also campaign for the rights of minorities and advocate a socio-ecological tax reform. Their basic values according to their charter in 2001 are, "...direct democracy, nonviolence, ecology, solidarity, feminism and self-determination." The party is a member of the European Green Party and Global Greens. The Greens currently have no seats in the National Council. Over the past decade, it had polled 11.0, 10.4, and 12.4% in federal elections. However, in 2017, the party was beset with internal difficulties including the defection of its entire youth wing. In the 2017 general election, the party suffered a disastrous defeat, losing all 24 of its seats by failing to clear the 4% hurdle to get representation in Parliament. The Green Party spokesperson from Lower Austria, Helga Krisma Huber described it as a «catastrophe». The party has two seats but no parliamentary group in the less powerful Federal Council. History While the Austrian Green movement began in 1978 with the successful campaign to prevent the opening of the nuclear power plant in Zwentendorf which had been favoured by Bruno Kriski's government, the Green Party was born in 1984 during the sit-in protests which prevented the Danube power plant at Hainburg from being built. Federal level In the 1986 parliamentary elections the Green Party started off with 4.82% of all votes cast and entered Parliament with eight National Council mandates. In the early elections to National Council in 2002, the Green Party nationwide received 9.47% of votes, and won 17 mandates to the National Council. At that time, it was the highest number of votes garnered by any European Green Party. When the Greens took their seats in Parliament for the first time, they chose to appear somewhat unconventional. They initially refused to adapt their behaviour to that of the other parties, an example of this is their refusal to elect a chairperson and designated a puppet made out of straw instead. Delegates would appear in Parliament dressed in casual wear such as jeans and trainers. Worldwide attention was drawn when the Green delegate Andreas Wabl hoisted a swastika flag on the Speaker's podium in the Austrian Parliament, protesting against then Federal President Kurt Waldheim. After the national election in 2002, the Greens entered into preliminary negotiations about a possible coalition government with the Conservative OVP. During negotiations, party leadership was accused of internally blackmailing skeptical members. Negotiations between the two parties were subsequently called off, after the results with the OVP were not sufficient. The Green Youth Organization Grünalternative Jugend Green Alternative Youth or GAJ briefly occupied the rooms of the Green Parliamentary Club in the Austrian Parliament building in protest. In 2003 three Green Federal Councillors formed their own club in the Upper House Federal Council of Parliament. 
After the 2006 elections the Greens gained four seats and ended up with 21 seats and became the third largest party in Parliament, however did not have enough mandates to form a coalition government with either the Austrian People's Party or Social Democratic Party and became the largest opposition party, while the SPO and OVP formed a grand coalition government. As of 2018, the Greens have no seats in the Nationalrat or official group status in the Bundesrat. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Chairperson since 1986. The chart below shows a timeline of the Green chairpersons and the chancellors of Austria. The left green bar shows all the chairpersons, Bundesbrecher, abbreviated as CP of the Green Party, and the right bar shows the corresponding makeup of the Austrian government at that time. The red SPO and black OVP colors correspond to which party led the federal government, Bundesregierung, abbreviated as Govern. The last names of the respective chancellors are shown. The Roman numeral stands for the cabinets. Topic. Federal state level The Green Party also entered the parliaments or assemblies Landtag of Austrian federal states and communal governments. Following is an analysis of the party on the federal state Lander level. <inaudible> Bergenland the Bergenland Greens were able to take their seats in the federal state parliament Landtag for the first time in 2000. The party received 5.49% of the tally, which meant two mandates. In the federal state elections in 2005 these two seats were reaffirmed with 5.21% received of all votes cast. Carinthia. <coughs> <coughs> In the southernmost federal state Carinthia, different Green Parties ran state elections, the Kel, Al in 1984, Anders Kanten in 1989 and 1994, and Demokratie 99 in 1999. These parties were, however, never able to enter the federal state assembly, since the Carinthian voting system requires a party to win a direct mandate in one of the four regional election districts, which effectively means a 10% threshold in order to enter. Only in 2004 were the Carinthian Greens finally able to take their seats in the federal state assembly, where they are represented by cabaret artist Rolf Holub and Barbara Lesjak. On a regional level, for example in the federal state capital Klagenfurt, the Carinthian Greens have already played a political role for a longer time. In the Klagenfurt City Council, the Greens are represented by Andrea Wulz, Matthias Kochel, Angelika Hodel and Reinhold Gasper. Since the local election in 2003, the Klagenfurt Greens were able to take one of nine seats in the proportional city government. Andrea Wulz is the town councillor for issues relating to women, family matters, and social housing projects. Topic: <laughs> Lower Austria. In 1998 the Lower Austrian Greens were represented with two delegates in the Federal State Assembly. In the federal state elections in 2003 the Greens received 7.22% and thus won four mandates, which enabled them to form a parliamentary group, called Club in Austrian Politics, in the Assembly. With Madeleine Petrovic, the Lower Austrian Greens have a former federal spokeswoman and one of the most outspoken animal activists of Austria as their leader In 2005 the Lower Austrian Greens managed to win and take their seats in 100 municipal assemblies and as of 2005 had four vice mayors. Their managing director in Lower Austria is Thomas Huber. Salzburg After the federal state elections in 1989 the Salzburg State Greens had two mandates in the Salzburg Federal State Assembly, in 1994–3 and in 1999 again two. 
Under the leadership of Syriac Schweighofer the Greens performed under their expectations in the 2004 federal state elections and could not achieve the desired club status of at least three mandates. As voter current analyses showed, the small increases in votes were largely due to former voters of the Liberal Forum which did not run in the Salzburg elections. In March 2009 they were down from 8% to 7.3%, keeping their two seats in Salzburg State's parliament. The Bürgerliste citizen list is the common platform of the Greens in Salzburg municipality. Like many other autonomous municipal groups it carries its own name. Styria <inaudible> <inaudible> The Styrian Greens have three delegates sitting in the Federal State Assembly, Federal State Spokesperson Lambert Schonleitner, Sandra Krautwaschel, and Lara Koch. There are two independent Greens parties, on the one hand the Federal State Party, on the other hand there is the Die Grünen, alternative Liste Graz party for the Federal State Capital Graz. In the Graz City Council the Greens are represented by Sigi Binder, Lisa Rucker, Hermann Kandusi and Christina Jahn. Styria has the largest Austrian Green Youth organization in Austria, called Grün Jugend Steiermark Green Youth Styria. Beside the Green Youth Styria there also exists Austria's first Green Students organization, the Eco Students. Tyrol in Tyrol the Greens official name, Die Grünen, Die Grün Alternative Tyrol were able to win seats and placed in 1994 Eva Lichtenberger as Austria's first Green State councillor in a local government, responsible for environmental affairs. The 2003 Tyrolean Landtag State Assembly elections were the best ever for the Austrian Greens, winning 15.59% of all votes cast. In the capital city of Innsbruck the Greens reached approximately 27% of the vote. The Tyrolean election result also meant that the Greens could for the first time in history nominate a member to the Upper House of Parliament. Since 2003 the Green delegate to the Federal Council of Parliament is Eva Konrad, former chairlady of the Austrian National Union of Students of the University of Innsbruck. The communal elections of 2004 brought a doubling of the mandates for the Tyrolean Greens. City elections in Innsbruck in 2006 were a success for the Greens and they now have eight of the 40 seats in the Parliament of Innsbruck. In the elections to the European Parliament the Tyrolean Greens obtained 17.32%, their best result until then. Eva Lichtenberger subsequently changed her position to become a member of the European Parliament MEP. The results in Innsbruck were particularly good, there the Green Party received 28.28%, which made it the strongest party, even before the Christian Democratic OVP and the Social Democratic SPO. The Greens were able to score on a number of issues that they have been fighting for years. Besides the social topics above all the problems of transit traffic over the Alps was important. The Tyrolean Greens have experts on traffic issues with MEP Eva Lichtenberger, the national speaker and club chairperson Georg Willi and the speaker of Group of Regional of Innsbruck Gerhard Fritz. The issue of transit traffic through the Tyrol is of great importance, because the state is troubled by the massive transit traffic between Germany and Italy over the Brenner Pass. Since the Tyrol sits right in between Germany and Italy, the bulk of the commercial traffic passes through there. This heavy duty traffic has devastating effects on the fragile Alpine environment and decreases the quality of life for the inhabitants. Since the entry to the European Union, Austria had to give up any quota limitations on how much international traffic coming from EU countries is allowed to pass through its territory. The Tyrolean Greens accused to federal government of not having pushed for a better deal with the European Union concerning transit traffic and in effect abandoning the concerns of the citizens. They also heavily criticized the government's failure to negotiate a follow-up of the 1994 transit treaty signed with the EU. Apart from the Greens, various anti-transit civic movements have formed to protest against the environmental damages caused by the traffic. 
Sitting in the National Council is Kurt Grunewald, a Tyrolean Member of Parliament, as well as the former leader of the Greens Alexander van der Bellen, who has Tyrolean roots he spent a part of his youth there and went to high school in Innsbruck. The results of the Tyrolean Landtag elections 2003 delegates, Sepp Brugger, Maria Scheiber, Uschi Schwarzel, Elisabeth Wiesmüller und Georg Willi Club Chairman. 1999 delegates Maria Scheiber, Elizabeth Wiesmüller, Georg Willi, Club Chairman. 1994 delegates Bernhard Ernst, Franz Kludge, Max Schneider und Georg Willi, Club Chairman, Club Obmann. 1989 delegates Eva Lichtenberger, Jutta Seethaler, Franz Kludge. Topic: <laughs> Upper Austria. In 1997 the Upper Austrian Greens successfully entered the Upper Austrian Landtag state assembly for the first time. After the state elections in 2003 state elections in Upper Austria are held every six years, not five like in the other states, the Greens were able to win even further seats. The campaign was already aimed at gaining ministerial seats in the state government. Since the conservative Christian Democratic OVP was the strongest party, this would have meant for the Greens to enter into a coalition government with them the so-called Schwarz-Grun Black-Green coalition, named after the party colors. This new political constellation was quite controversial amongst party members on both sides. In the Green Party, the leader Rudi Anschober was able to convince party members and after some dealing became state councillor for environmental affairs. The Greens of the state capital of Linz under the leadership of city councillor Jürgen Himmelbauer were most against this black-green project. On the national level, the Upper Austrian Greens were able to nominate and send to the Parliamentary Upper House Federal Council councillor Rupert Lichtenecker. Topic: Vorarlberg. The Vorarlberg Greens were the first to ever win mandates in an Austrian state assembly election. Already in 1984, they were able to win 13% of the votes in the Vorarlberg state assembly elections, which for that time was an absolute sensation. The charismatic Alpine farmer Kaspernays Simmer from Bregenzerwald was the leading candidate, it was mainly due to his efforts why the party was so instantly successful. Because of their strength, the Greens were allowed to form their own parliamentary fraction club, which caused some logistical problems as the newly constructed Landtag building in 1981 only provided space for the traditional three parties OVP, SPO, Euro, not four. Since the traditional organic farming sector is important in the Western Austrian regions, the Greens were able to gain support. In the following years the Greens were able to consolidate their position by gaining seats on the communal and municipal level. Occasionally they lost their official club status in the State Assembly, when they fared poorly from 1999 to 2004. In 2006 the Speaker of the Vorarlberg Greens was Johannes Rauch. The results of the Vorarlberg Landtag elections One combined result of Allo and Vigo <inaudible> Vienna The Viennese Greens started nominating candidates in the Vienna Gemeinderat municipal council or state assembly in 1983 and were able to enter in 1991. Over the years they have been able to continually gather support. A lot of support has been coming from former Liberal Forum voters, after the Liberals failed to enter any legislature. The traditional strongholds in Vienna for the Greens are the districts of Neubau 2005 43.26%, Josefstadt 32.26%, Olsegrund 29.43%, Mariahilf 28.97% and Wieden 25.14%. In the 2001 Gemeinderat elections, the Greens were able to win the majority of a district for the first time. In the district of Neubau they won 32.55% and were able to nominate the Bezirksvesteher mayor of the district. The results of 2001 also allowed the Viennese Greens to nominate Stefan Schenick as federal councillor to the Upper House of Parliament Bundesrat. 
But despite the strong gains, the Greens were not able to enter into a coalition government with the SPO, since the Social Democrats were able to win an absolute majority. The European Parliament election, 2004 were the best for the Viennese Greens so far. From the total tally, they received 22%, which put them ahead of the Christian Democratic OVP and placed them on second position behind the SPO In Neubau the Greens received 41%. They were also able to win first place in the districts of Wieden, Mariahilf, Josefstadt and Alsergrund. In the 2005 Gemeinderat elections, the Greens were able to win votes, but missed their target of becoming the second most powerful party and ended up on fourth place, right behind the right-wing Freedom Party Because of the different weighing by districts, the Greens received 14 mandates, one more than the Euro. They were also able to place another city councillor. In the districts, the party was able to consolidate their holding on Neubau, as well as win the majority of votes in Josefstadt. With that, the Greens were able to nominate a second Green District mayor. The second place was won in the districts of Leopoldstadt, Margareten, Mariahilf, Rudolfsheim Funfhaus and Alsergrund. The Green delegates to the Viennese Gemeinderat or Landtag as of 2006 were Maria Vasilaku, Club Chairlady, Club Obfrau, Waltro Antonov, Heidi Kamlander, Christoph Chorhair, Sabine Gretner, Suzanne Jerusalem, Alev Koren, Rudiger Marisch, Martin Margulies, Sigrid Pils, Ingrid Puller, Marie Ringler, Marco Schruder, Claudia Sommer Smolik. The two city councillors are David Ellenson and Monica Vanner. The 2010 results meant that the SPO was unable to hold the majority of seats in the Vienna City Council and therefore had to rule together with the Greens performing for the first time as coalition partner. The current vice-governor, vice-mayor of Vienna is Maria Vasilaku. The results of the Viennese Gemeinderat elections One ran as alternative lister Wien ALW. Topic: Organization. In 2004, the Greens had about 3,000 members nationwide, although at present there are no uniform regulations for membership. Apart from the members, the Greens rely on a large number of volunteers. The party used to function on the principles of grassroots democracy, basis democracy, and rotation principle, rotation principle, but this was stopped in the course of the time. The last basic democratic element is the Eurabstimmung, which is a vote on any issue that can be initiated with the petition of at least 100 members. As of 2003 however, no such vote has taken place. The highest body is the Federal Congress, Bundescongress, which convenes at least once a year. All federal state organizations send delegates, also the immigrants organization is allowed to send delegates as the 10th Austrian state. The Federal Congress decides the electoral lists for the National Council elections and elections to the European Parliament. The Congress also elects the Federal Spokesperson The Congress also decides the party program and sets the party guidelines. In the last few years, the Federal Executive has developed into the actual decision-making centre. It meets at least once a week, mostly on Tuesdays, and determines the guidelines of daily politics. The federal executive also decides on party finances. The extended federal executive consists of a smaller number of delegates from each state and meets at least once a month. It takes care of the implementation of the party guidelines, which were set by the party congress. It also chooses the representatives of the party spokesperson. The highest office in the party is that of the federal spokesperson The party's federal spokesman is Werner Kogler. The federal state organizations are organized similarly, there are federal state meetings, which sometimes convene as a members meeting or a delegates meeting. Similar to the federal executive, there are federal state executives The party charter also allows for each federal state group to hold a vote on basic issues as well that affect the whole party. 
Independently in the National Council there also exists a Green National Council Club faction, which can independently specify its guidelines. In the last years however an increasing fusion of the work between party and its club was noticeable. Michaela Burney, successor of Franz Raft since June 2004 as the Greens' federal chairperson, was allowed to keep her National Council mandate. This means she is allowed to hold two offices at the same time, something that was frowned upon by the Greens previously. There are different Green or Greenish organizations within the party and associated with it. These include The Grünen Andersrum is the gay, lesbian and transgender organization, which is organized differently from state to state, and exists in all states except Vorarlberg and Bergenland. In Vienna, the Grünen Andersrum are a part of the party itself. The Grünen Seniorinnen is the organization for senior citizens. It was founded on March 9, 2001 in Vienna. The DGS fights for a policy more friendly to senior citizens and their right to lead an active, fulfilling and self-determined life. The initiative Grün Migrantinnen is the Green Group for Immigrants in Austria. Their demands are a facilitation of integration into life in Austria, equal rights and equal opportunities, fight against racism and other issues concerning migrants. The Grün und Alternative Studyrunde is a separate party which candidates in the elections for the Austrian National Union of Students There they are the biggest faction, together with the Socialist Students of Austria Verband Sozialistischer Studentinnen Österreichs, Vastu they form the executive committee of the Austrian National Union for Students. The Grünalternative Jugend is the youth organization of the Green Party. The GAJ existed since the 1990s. It is a member of the Federation of Young European Greens The GAJ sees itself rather as extreme left. The organization is subdivided into smaller groups for each state. The Grünfrauen organization is the organization for women. As of 2005, it does not exist yet in every state. Eco Students is a green students organization, which currently only exists in Styria. The Grün Wirtschaft is the green economic organization and runs in the elections for the economic parliament of the Austrian Federal Economic Chamber The Alternative und Unabhängige Gewerkschafterinnen is the Green Labour Union. It runs in the elections for the Labour Parliament of the Austrian Labour Chamber Arbeiterkammer, AK. .The education and training of new green politicians is done by the Grün Bildungswerkstatt, which is an independent voluntary association. The Grün Bildungswerkstatt is financed by the Republic, as regulated by Austrian law for the equal treatment of all parliamentary parties. Electoral results Topic Parliament Parliament Topic President In the 2016 Austrian presidential election, Alexander van der Bellen won the election with 50.35% of the votes and defeated Norbert Hofer the Freedom Party of Austria politician who received 49.65% of the vote. Van der Bellen will become the first president from the Greens. On 1 July, the Constitutional Court overturned the result of the election and ordered a redo because of irregularities during the counting process. On 4 December 2016 Van der Bellen won the re-run of the second round with 53.79% of the votes to Hofer's 46.21%. European Parliament Prominent members 
Among the most notable founding members and mentors are or were Professor Alexander Tolman, the painter Friedensrich Hundertwasser, the late actor Herbert Fux, the mayor of Stereg Joseph Buchner the first Green Mayor in Austria, in 1987 excluded from the Green Parliamentary Club, Frieda Meissner Blau and Gunther Nenning, with Nobel Prize laureate Konrad Lorenz supporting the 1984 protests at Hainburg. Today, green politicians include in alphabetical order Rudolf Anschober, state councillor of Upper Austria, Thomas Blimlinger, mayor of the Viennese district Neubau, Dieter Bross, former MP, former member of the Lower House National Council, spokesman for education, Christoph Chorher, member of the State Assembly of Vienna, Eva Glorischnig Pieschzik, former MP, former federal spokeswoman. Werner Kogler, federal spokesperson. Ulrike Lunacek, former MEP, former spokeswoman for foreign policy. Carlo Ellinger, former MP, deputy federal speaker. Madeleine Petrovich, club chairperson of the Lower Austrian Greens. Johannes Rauch, club chairperson and state speaker for Vorarlberg. Marie Ringler, former member of the Viennese State Assembly, spokeswoman for culture and technology. Michaela Burney, former MP, spokeswoman for the economy, former federal executive manager of the party. Theresia Stoizetz, ombudswoman, former MP and spokeswoman for minorities. Ingrid Lechner Sonic, club chairperson of the Styrian Greens. Alexander van der Bellen, former federal speaker, club chairman in the National Council, president of Austria. Maria Vasilaku, club chairperson of the Viennese Greens, vice mayor. Georg Willy, club chairperson and state speaker for the Tyrol. Topic: Members of the European Parliament. Mercedes Etcherer, MEP from 1999 to 2004. Eva Lichtenberger, MEP since 2004, member of the Austrian National Convention. Johannes Vogenhuber, MEP from 1995 to 2009, member of the European Convention, member of the Charter of Fundamental Rights of the European Union. Ulrike Lunacek, 2009 to 2017. Topic. See also. Green Party Green Politics List of environmental organizations Anti-nuclear movement in Austria <laughs>